beautiful. Yes. Oh, so hot. Spring is sprung. Unpleasant. Hello everyone, Guardian E here with another video in Fire Emblem Heroes, and this time taking on the Tiki and Noe Bound Hero Battle that released earlier today. And this one's pretty much a cakewalk. Uh, you can tackle it any number of ways, it's pretty simple overall, which is totally fine. Uh, I think it's good that they are mixing in some, uh, some harder maps for advanced players and some easier maps for newer players. I think this definitely caters towards the newer players. Uh, but just a couple of things that I wanted to note that you may want to watch out for in your first approach. On this Bound Hero battle, uh, for one thing, both Noe and Tiki each have uh, a one-turn cooldown on their Iceberg and Bonfire, respectively, so do want to watch out for that. It, you do want to be prepared to tank a hit from one of them on your first engagement. Noe is also using Dull Ranged 3, you know, often used to, util to neutralize uh, Blade Tomes. Blade to him damage as well as you know, emblem buffs, hones, and fortifies. The Axe Dragon here has Guidance, uh, which can be a little bit tricky. Uh, he's surrounded by infantry, so obviously, um, as they move into position, you know, let's say that you move uh, somebody in to attack Noe here, uh, the dragon could, could move into this position, and you know, any one of the infantry could teleport right in front of them to attack. So you, do, you, know, you just want to watch out for it. Uh, this green mana keep, for some reason, is usually using Wind Sweep, uh, which is very odd. Uh, it's an odd choice considering that that her speed really isn't all that great at 33. I, I believe it's meant to combo uh, with Tiki's Chill Speed, uh, which would you know decrease the speed of 
the enemy with the highest speed uh, on the opposing team. So I think that's supposed to be the combination, but you know, really it's, it's not too much of a threat. Uh, and everything else is really just uh, you know watching out for the defense tiles and, and, and taking them on. So uh, first thing we're going to do is we're just going to move Spring up into strong. position here. Let's go. Best wishes. Yes. And uh, on the first engagement, we're just going to attack Noe right away. Okay. And next, we're just going to move into position. Fun. Move Corrin over to Hinoka so that she is getting the hone buff. Um, yes. Move New Year's Corrin over here to uh, reposition. Spring Camilla to safety. And we yes. will leave Hinoki here. Okay, so next we can just take on this Manicute right now with New Year's Camilla. Just take him out easy peasy. Activate Gale Force. Okay, we'll just go ahead and reposition her in back to safety, and then we will go ahead and move Hinoka out of the way. Uh, we'll yes. move New Year's Camilla over to make sure that she gets the buff. And we'll just go ahead and move yes. Summer Corn down here to safety out of the way. Okay, that allows Spring Camilla to go ahead and sneak in that kill uh, against the Blue Mage. Okay, so Let's next go. up we can just go ahead and take out this uh, Red Sword Fighter, no problem, with Hinoka. Best wishes. And we'll just move back into well, T formation so that everybody gets fun. that delicious home buff. Okay, so Ooh, despite so the defense hot. tile, Corrin uh, with her Blade Tome is going to very easily be able to take out Tiki right here. She'll take substantial damage, but that's fine. Let's and we'll go. just go ahead and situate ourselves. We'll move New Year's Camilla over in the range of the Axe Flyer. Yes. Uh, and then we will also go ahead and move uh, Summer Corrin out of danger. And Beautiful. we'll move uh, Spring Camilla up here so that she gets the home as well. Perfect. Uh, now we just move uh, Spring wow. Camilla up, reposition her forward to do what she does best, and take out this uh, Blue Dragon, Noe. So really simple. A, a very straightforward Bound Hero battle. Uh, really nothing too tricky about this at all. They showed a preview during the Fae channel, and I was totally expecting there to be reinforcements or something else. But yeah, this really was very, very simple, very, very easy, um, and really not a whole lot to watch out for. So I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please feel free to leave a like, uh, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more Fire Emblem Heroes content. I thank you so, so, so much for watching. We really, really appreciate it. And until next time, let's protect those skies.